the fetuses, one of the babies, has gotten a heart rate that is unusual and so we have to monitor the heart to make sure that it's beating at a high enough rate so that the baby can survive in utero. And once we're starting to see a decline, or if we do see a decline, then we'll go ahead and um, have the babies early, because there's twins, so they have to come both at the same time. We can't leave one in, in, and take the other one out. So that makes this situation very unique. In, in the setting of complete heart block, while the upper chamber is still signaling each heartbeat, it's not being transmitted through the AV node, so the lower chamber of the heart doesn't have a signal to beat. It's certainly best to be in utero as long as possible, but if there's ever a sign that the baby in heart block is doing poorly, then we need to make a decision about early delivery. Because what we would want to do with that baby is deliver the baby and then get their rhythm to, to a healthier level. And that's generally done through some form of pacemaker. So far we're status quo, which for us in this situation actually is good. So uh, the prognosis at this point is um, we're doing okay. We're doing okay. Thinking positive. Thinking positive, that's right. I think it's important to be able to provide uh, a lot of information. And so this particular family uh, appreciates uh, the amount of information we're able to provide to them. And I think that on a weekly basis, um, after our visits, the family's reassured that things are going well, that they're uh, getting good care. And they like to know that there's a plan in place for after the baby's born. So one of the cardiologists will be present at the time of delivery. If the baby needs immediate pacing, we have uh, the ability to pace the baby externally uh, until uh, he or she is transferred to the hospital here and then our surgeon is prepared at any, any moment to put a pacemaker in as needed. I am the happiest person in the world. I am, I am. He's doing great and our other twin is healthy and at home and this little guy they whisked away right after he was born. I Sadly I didn't get to see much of him but they took him away because he needed to have his surgery, his heart surgery for the pacemaker and, and so they basically uh, took him immediately after birth and they had surgery on him six hours after he was born. And they put the pacemaker in successfully and I don't think there were any problems at all. So, we're happy. New parents. New, happy new parents.